She also calls 999 for help, asks for a person to fetch a defibrillator, and carries out chest compressions with her hands interlocked, at 2 beats per second. The pro dancer partnered with Resuscitation Council UK to record new moves to Ali Mer's hit classic, Heart Skips a Beat. The star told her 325,000 TikTok fans, I've done the hashtag Resuspa challenge to raise awareness about cardiac arrest. Did you know three quarters of British adults know CPR, but less than half feel confident performing it? In five simple steps, you can learn how to save a life. I challenge my sister at Motsi Mabusa Tant's Shul and the beautiful at This Is Davina McCall to take part and do the dance. Other celebrity stars, including ITV's The Masked Dancer presenter Davina McCall, and Odie's sister, Motsi Mabuse, have been urged to film their own version of the dance to raise awareness about the importance of CPR. And also participating in the new trend is TV presenter and actor Kareem Zarawal, who has filmed his own version of the dance. TikTokers have been encouraged to record their own version of OT's dance and share on their social media platforms, as figures show almost three quarters have been told how to perform the life-saving skill, but less than half of those, 44%, feel confident administering it. Esther Cuckoo, director of communications at Resuscitation Council UK, said, Having Odie on Bard to choreograph such a creative and engaging dance will help raise awareness of CPR, and highlight just how easy it is to learn. The more people who know how to perform this life-saving skill, the more chance people have of surviving a cardiac arrest, which can happen to anyone at any time, so everyone needs to know that their two hands could save a life. The dance was recorded after the charity conducted research, via one poll, which found that just 2 in 5 adults, 41%, knew where to find a defibrillator. And worryingly, less than a third, 29%, know how to use a defibrillator on someone in cardiac arrest. Almost a quarter, 23%, said they would leave a person in cardiac arrest to phone an ambulance, something which is strongly advised against by Resuscitation Council UK. Esther Cuckoo added, while it's encouraging that almost three quarters of adults say they know how to perform CPR, there is always room to learn and develop these skills, particularly for those who may not have brushed up on it for some time. We believe Odie's video will go some way to ensure engagement and embed confidence in performing CPR. To learn more, visit at Rhesus Council Accor Rhesus. Org.uk slash Odie